Hi, Jackie and Taman. So it's been one week since Kaylee Gansberg, who grew up here in Lyle, was killed in a hit and run near her university campus in Kalamazoo, Michigan. Tonight, Lyle Community Park filled up with Kaylee's family and some of her closest friends for a candlelight vigil in her honor. That as we shed tears, we would know that you weep with us. With white carnations and candles in hand, heavy hearts in this crowd embraced, consoling one another as they remember 21 year old Kaylee Gansberg's bright spirit. A lot of these people they haven't seen in like years from high school, and to have them all show up here and show support to my family and Alex, her brother, and everyone's really, really heartwarming. Kaylee, a Western Michigan University senior, looked forward to a bright future as an artist. Kaylee was really artistic, just a heart of gold. Um, she had always a quick wit, which I always admired about her. Tragically, Kaylee was killed last Saturday in Kalamazoo, Michigan, after she was hit by a driver who her family says was out on bail for a DUI. I say that the world is a little less brighter without her, but she really is our shining that I know will just be with us for the rest of our lives in the small and big moments. As candles lit up Lyle Community Park, Kaylee's family was overwhelmed by the outpouring of support from those who knew Kaylee and many who did not. I love that everyone's wearing white. <laughs> Seems like just really fitting because she's our angel now and we miss her. After a moment of silence and prayer, loved ones and friends shared their love for the flourishing artist whose life positively impacted infinite lives. I just pray that no one ever has a feel Kaylee's memorial service is tomorrow afternoon in Downers Grove. Reporting live in Lyle, I'm Jewel Hillary, WGN News.